All right, so here we are looking at the dorsal side of the hand with the ligaments attached. And let's begin by exploring a couple of the bones that we already know. This is, of course, the ulna. This is the radius. And this ligamentous attachment in between is a syndesmosis, which we refer to as the antibrachial interosseous membrane. Let's take a look at some of these ligaments now. This particular ligament is the ulnar carpal ligament, and because it is on the dorsal side, we'll give it the name dorsal ulnar carpal ligament. This is the radial carpal ligament, and of course, since it's on the dorsal side, we'll call it the dorsal radial carpal ligament. As we get here, we have carpal metacarpal ligaments, again, from the dorsal side, so they are dorsal carpal metacarpal ligaments. And then if you take a look here, in between the fingers, these are deep transverse metacarpal ligaments. Deep transverse metacarpal ligaments. And of course, the ligaments here are metacarpal phalangeal ligaments, again on the dorsal side. So dorsal metacarpal phalangeal ligaments. That's true with the thumb as well. The joints here are simply referred to as uh, interphalangeal joints, and of course there's also ligaments associated with them. So interphalangeal ligaments and joints. And if we spin this around, we can appreciate how we have the same situation here. So transverse metacarpal ligaments, right? Good. Um, all right, well, let's back up just a little bit here and take a look at the radius attaching to the carpals. The radial carpal ligament on this particular side is the palmar radial carpal ligament, and of course, we have the ulnar radial carpal ligament. Um, likewise, we have palmar fascia right here, which is framed by two tendons. This particular tendon is the tendon of the flexor carpi radialis muscle, and this particular tendon is the tendon of the flexor carpi ulnaris muscle. You can appreciate that we also have a space in between here, and this of course would be the carpal tunnel. So I've got my little probe right in the carpal tunnel right here. Okay, that should just about do it.